Hi YouTube, welcome back to my channel. It's a happy new year. Me and Mills are at the airport, it's f***ing 5am. And we're going to Dubai. And guess what we've just done? Upgraded to business. <laughs> I don't know why I just did that. We thought, wow, we've both had a really f***ing horrific okay. year. We thought, why don't we get ourselves a little present? Oh, See, we're, we're going to be snogging each other yeah. when the clock strikes 12. Our flight's not taking off till 10 now, it's one hour delay. We're gonna go and check out what the airport's saying. Cause you upgraded though, I'm definitely not getting a handbag, which was my original plan. We're in the business class one. <laughs> a little sausage. Oh, I'm not even hungry, but I've got this disease where when I come to the airport, I must have a hot breakfast. And I've got some champagne. Update, we're in the lounge. I think I'm, my hands are <laughs> cold, my hand is. Okay. That you've that part of your hand. No, it's not even fake tan. This is Garnier body lotion that I use to moisturize before I tanned. Lisa, how can I have some more? Lisa, can I have some more fake tan? <laughs> That's Oliver Twist once said. We couldn't figure out. Well, I. That is the sound that they make in hell. I feel like when you go in business class lounge, she says, whilst sipping a mullet, you actually see what real wealth looks it's like. I agree. We also had the probably deepest conversation we will ever have <laughs> about Tupper Bowers. No, no, about how the world started. <laughs> the Big Bang Theory. A million and evolution. Yeah, and we really were then talking about that and then also how Justin Bieber's an alligator. And I had to show Millie because she didn't know that he was an alligator. Why does my camera just go out of focus? I feel like my viewers are used to this by now. <laughs> and if you're new here, I'm sorry, I don't f***ing know why it does it. Right, hello gang, we are in business. Me and Millie went out and next to each other, but we begged, borrowed and steal. And basically just asked really politely. And now we're in our own little thing, the plane, which is unreal. Hello gang, we've got to the hotel. So we're staying at the Shangri-La in downtown, and the room is crazy. You can come in, there's lots of mirrors. Just so you can see how rough I look. And this is the bathroom. We have a huge bath. And this is the, the only thing is, we're on, we got an upgrade. We got <laughs> upgraded to the smoker's floor. Which <laughs> is just unreal. We don't smoke. Look at this. The Burj Khalifa. Where's Khalifa lives up there. We're just gonna chill for a bit and assess the situation. Hello peeps. We are at our hotel bar and it's Stunning, look at that. I actually asked a girl to put this me because I don't know about hotels in Dubai, okay? I've been once, came with JD, still at the Andas. Loved it, but wanted to stay somewhere else, you know, switch it up. So we're here, we're just gonna have a vodka Red Bull. It's half 12. <laughs> so now's the time for a Red Bull, actually. <laughs> <laughs> we could go to a club, but I don't know if I want to go to a club, to be honest. We'll just see what happens. Because I don't want to go to a club and get and then ruin my holiday on day one. No. I don't even like clubs. Um, I used to be a club rat, not anymore. Hey gang, we're up. Woo. We're looking like a pair of single moms on holiday. <laughs> we're at the mall and we're gonna go to the Cheesecake Factory. I'm hungry. I'm sorry, I think it's this way. We're at the Cheesecake Factory and I ordered a coat. <laughs> You'd like to be bigger than your head. Right, these are our starters. We've got some buffalo chicken, fried macaroni and cheese. We've also ordered everything off the main <laughs> menu. <laughs> and the woman went, you're eating a lot of food today. <laughs> right, we've got some tacos, a pasta, enchiladas. As you can tell, our eyes are definitely bigger than our belly. I feel ill. No one told me that the portions in the Cheesecake Factory are like enough for a family of four. I was thinking as well, we've got the stars in the main, like who can come here and buy a star in a main in cheesecake? Like that is a lot good. So I think we might have a little look around and then we're going to go back to the hotel, catch some rays and chill before we go to the opera tonight. But actually I'm just seeing on Instagram and loads of people I know are flying out today. Well Phoenix is on the way but she's coming anyways. But yeah, so I feel like this is going to be a big link up. Big Betty girl, good evening. We've just had a two hour nap, okay? The jet lag is real. There's not even a jet lag, but 
Just ordered some room service, got some Cosmos and they gave us some crisps, which is unreal. We're getting ready because we're going to Opa tonight, which is where they smash the plates. I'm wearing a sick outfit tonight. I'm channeling my inner Kim K. There's a sneak preview, throwing it down on the floor. So that's what's going on. Let's open these Cosmos and do a taste test. Oh, that's got fucking alcohol in it. Just like that. We've got to finish the TikTok. Oh, shit. We're doing a TikTok and it's gonna be a really good one. Okay, watch this space. I'm ready, look at Mills. Watch this space. Sex. Oh my god, look how much it's glistening. Oh, it's really cool. No. Oh, I'm really not sick. Right, we are in Wapa. Wapa. We've got Tarmac Lata and Pittsburgh. Let's see if it's nice. I think that has dairy in it, and if it does, I am going to. Dinner, we got the same. Fry on the floor. I will. <laughs> Hang on a minute. I haven't bought this out yet. Yeah. I hate this fresh one. Opa! I hate this fresh one. Opa! Guys, I don't even want to fucking tell you what happened last night or where we went or anything else. Just know we got in at 6am. The time now is 2pm and we're ready to go to Cove Beach where we're going to meet Phoenix. But let me tell you, this morning, man, what the fuck? It was a bad morning for Mills and Co. Don't worry though. We've come to Cove Beach and we've slept. Thank you. We were slept and now we're just laughing at everything and we both just weed in the sea. And here's what we ordered. Very average. Right, oh no. Do you know that thing, main character complex, where you think everyone's looking at you? Stop looking at me. Last night, we were with Drake and Mike Tyson's son. And he was the loveliest bloke I've ever met. I need five minutes to come, so basically best friends, we're gonna go traveling together. Hello vlog. It's been 24 hours because we left Cove Beach early because we were unwell, basically. We were so hungover from the night before. We couldn't speak. So we left Cove, went back to our hotel. So we napped for two hours. We were meant to go out for dinner and I didn't even get out of bed. Millie had a shower and almost made it. Thank you. Then we looked at each other and thought, f*** this. Because if we had gone out last night, we wouldn't have been able to do anything today. So we got a Chinese takeaway, which then made us both really ill. <laughs> Basically, I think the Chinese we got it from must have put so much MSG in it. Mills didn't sleep until 6 a.m. She just couldn't. And I woke up this morning and been ill. Anyways, then we said, because we don't want to waste a day, why don't we go and see the Burj Khalifa, get some food near it, and then come back to our hotel to get ready for tonight. Little did we know that every single person in the whole of Dubai would be coming here to get a spot for the fireworks tonight. So we've just walked, I'd say maybe two miles to get into the mall. We're saying we have come too far to turn around now. I was debating booking an Uber just back to the hotel. So yeah, now we're in the mall. We're gonna get some food. I'm not really that hungry, but I know I need to eat. Hi guys, what's going on? So after we've had a very traumatic 18 hours, we've just decided to extend our flight. <laughs> so we'll be staying for another two days. I'm not sure why we did that. We're just having some buffalo wings and thought <laughs> we do another two days. I do feel like, because we didn't go out last night, we want to make more of it. This is my outfit. I thought I'd wear latex because it's not hot enough in Dubai, so I thought I'd bring the heat. But this is Mills' outfit. Too oh my god, it's guys. so glittery, isn't it? Is it? You look like a shining star. Oh. <laughs> Hello YouTube, I've been really bad at vlogging but yesterday I was just too hungover to even look at my camera 
New Year's Eve was ridiculous. But it is the 2nd of January and it's about quarter to one. I think we haven't adjusted to the time here, but I have actually managed to get someone to come and do my lashes because I've got none left and I basically land and then I go to South Africa, I don't have time to go and get my lashes done. So she's on her way and I need to sleep more. But we're gonna go by the pool today, I think. So before we go to Namos this evening, our table's at 10. Hey gang, what's going on? This camera just doesn't f***ing focus. Anyways, we've recovered from our first few days and now we're having a few cocky teas. Cocky teas. And an espresso. So I've lost the toenail again, so that's f***ing cool. How the hell, like, that night, Chloe lost the toenail and then I had blood just all over my foot and I wasn't sure where it was from your toenail, like, from my foot or something. Oh, that's fine. No, but I've got, like, little cuts, like, everywhere, all over my feet. Oh. And we basically walked barefoot for 30 minutes. But it's 45, we lied to you about the time. <laughs> You are lying. No, but for the cab, said it was gonna be an hour. I thought you said three hours. You lied about that as well. You said for three hours. <laughs> Update we had two drinks, got drunk, went shopping. <laughs> so I bought some plasters and bandages because I've lost a fucking toenail, which is great. And then we went to the Oud shop. I bought this one. Oh, this one. Basically, whenever we've gone out, I smell this really strong oud. And it must be like the most popular scent here or something. Anyways, we were trying these ouds and I tried this one and it smelled the holiday. So, as Anna Paul says, you always must buy a perfume to remind you of your holiday. Although, in the airport, I did buy this Dior, <laughs> which is really nice. And then I bought this one because it basically smells like the perfume I wore in Love Island, but much nicer and it lasts longer. Then Millie bought the strongest f***ing perfume I've smelled in my life. Comes in this huge box. Oh my and God. it's a men's one, but it's really f***ing nice. But that's a Millie smell, that one. I like more vanilla -y ones and she likes like, woody ones. Really musky. That's mu really musky. musky. So that's basically what happened. Finish shopping, now we're gonna get ready to go to Namas, which I'm excited for. I don't know what to wear though, because I'm f***ing getting the Dubai stone on this holiday. We're doing another TikTok series behind the scenes. We have to dance for like 10 seconds with no music. <laughs> <laughs> right, video. The boys are liar. The boys are liar. The boys are liar. The boys are liar. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I'm embarrassed. But see it on TikTok. <laughs> Hello, we have been to Avenue, the club. It was fun-ish. It was f***ing Ramo and we were like in the alley. We were on a table but we were in like an alleyway. Everyone just kept shoving me. And Muz was like, I don't want to be here. So I was like, I don't want to be here either. So we left and we've all done McDonald's because we're going to a beach club tomorrow. That is what we're we are doing. We're going up at 11am. get our sh** together. No, no, no. We're, beach club isn't till 2. We can get up at 12. No, I'm thinking 11am, get up, have food. Because we need to get there as well. So we need to be ready for one. Anyways, we're going to wait for the McDonald's. Show you when it gets here. And then we will resume daytime filming. I need a book and show you oh, my hair. And I've got some nuggets and chicken selects. Mmm. 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 I think McDonald's is the best just food on the planet. Taste test. Wow. Rise and shine. Good morning. The time now is. Oh. Oh, half one, not good morning, it's good afternoon. <laughs> but we've got a massage coming here. Someone messaged me on Instagram and was like, oh, do you want a complimentary massage? I was like, yeah, I do. So I've had a shower. Put a face mask on, got a bagel on the way, and then we're gonna have a massage. And then what are we gonna do? We're gonna go to the beach club. But I'm thinking we'll get there quite late. Yeah. It's just a bit pointless. Except by the pool there. Yeah. So that's our day. We are at the pool. Basically, we just had someone messaged me on Instagram, Reva or Reva, I don't know how you say it, and they said, Oh, do you want a complimentary massage where you're here? Of course I did. And do you know what else we're doing? 
We're writing our list for our food shop because we need to do one of those tomorrow when we're back in England. And then we just booked a PT session. I'm ready to drop a mortgage on a dinner. It's our last night, so it's our final treat. Guys, I'm embarrassed. So we had some cocktails <laughs> and they tasted just like porn star martinis. So is it all? Can I have two more? Oh no, she's coming over. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. Oh. Me. Anyways, we've got these cocktails, they're like lychee and passion fruit. And I said, oh, it tastes like a porn star, like porn star. She's like, what? And I whispered, I was said in her ear, I was like, do you know what a porn star is? She's like, oh my God. She's like, <laughs> and then she ran away. So I think that she thinks that I was telling her, oh, I'm a porn star, I'm a porn star. I'm not a porn star. I'm not even close. Anyway, she just came over and went, oh, porn star martini. And she was like, hey, you guys are so lovely. <laughs> Guys, we've got the black cob. I've heard so much about this. Basically, when I had Twitter and Instagram years and years ago, Joshua and ex Amity used to get black cob from Nobel all the time, and I just always wanted it. And I'm gonna have it. Here's the one more surprise for you. My brother is on my own. We were looking for a motive, but. What was it tired? And we made it to the airport. We were actually in there for hours, but I was just so tired I couldn't vlog. So, on the plane. Pretty different to the one we flew out in. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog as much as I enjoyed this holiday. <laughs> and I'll see you all next time. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe.